In this video, you'll see how to create cross-account, cross-region dashboards in AWS CloudWatch. With this capability, you can monitor applications running across multiple accounts and regions, centralize visibility of CloudWatch metrics and alarms, and drill down into more specific dashboards without having to switch accounts. To get started, let's navigate to the CloudWatch settings in our management account to configure cross-account, cross-region dashboards. We'll enable the viewing of metrics, dashboards, logs, and alarms from other accounts. Next, we'll enable the AWS Organization Account Selector, which provides a full list of accounts within our organization. Now let's switch to the view of a member account in our organization that has services running in a different region. In CloudWatch, we'll enable this account's data to be shared with the management account. To share our CloudWatch data, we must provide the account ID of the management account. We'll retain the default permission settings. Next, we'll launch a CloudFormation stack that creates an AWS Identity and Access Management IAM, role, enabling metrics to be shared across accounts. We'll retain the default settings and create the stack. Now that the stack has been created, let's look at the IAM role that was generated. Here we can see the policies that were automatically applied to the IAM role. Let's take a look at the trust relationships. The account ID of the management account we specified is listed as a trusted entity. Clicking the provided link shows the JSON policy document that contains this information. We've now successfully shared this account's CloudWatch data to the management account of our organization. Let's skip ahead to after we've repeated the cross-account sharing process for a second member account. We are now back in the management account, where we'll create a CloudWatch dashboard that aggregates member account metrics. We'll begin by adding a simple line widget. Next, we'll choose to view data from the running services in the first member account we configured. The account's services are running in the Northern Virginia region. We'll display log metrics. We can also optionally change the different graphed metrics and properties of the graph. Let's create the widget, then save the dashboard. We now have a central CloudWatch dashboard widget giving us incoming log events from a cross-region member account data source. We can add more widgets to our dashboard or more metrics to our existing widget. Let's do the latter. We'll graph the same metric from another member account in another region to show how similar metrics can be compared across regions and accounts in an organization. This account's services are running in the Ohio region. Let's update the widget. We can hover over the legend elements in the widget to see metric statistics for a single account and region. We can also create aggregate metrics from cross-region, cross-account data sources. Let's edit the widget to create an aggregate metric using the sum of the two metrics currently being graphed. Let's add a math expression that aggregates two metrics. The aggregated metric now appear in the graph as expression 1. Next, let's save our dashboard and add a new widget for a cross-account alarm. We'll display alarms from our first member account. All we have to do is select an alarm and create the widget. We can also add alarms to our dashboard by providing the Amazon resource name, or ARN. Let's add an alarm from the second member account. Let's add this alarm that's in an alarm state. We'll copy its ARN and add it to the dashboard's JSON source code. Our dashboard now contains alarms from across two different accounts in two different regions. You've just seen how to create cross-account, cross-region dashboards in AWS CloudWatch.
You can learn more about this topic in the description and links for this video. Thanks for watching. Now it's your turn to try.